Hi, I'm Ken Mills. I'm here at Dubai Creek Golf and Yacht Club with Golf Digest Middle East. And I'm here today to talk to you about the first move in the downswing. Now, last time I covered how to turn and load the backswing uh, into a better position. From there, we're going to give you just a simple feeling to start that downswing. Okay? So, when you turn to the top of your backswing into a good position, you really want to get the downswing starting from the lower half. Okay? Too many people start the downswing with their upper body and this is the wrong sequence. And if you start with your upper body, you're probably going to hit a variation of shots from there. So, what I want to do is just make you think about a simple throw in action. Okay? If I take a ball and try and throw it, the first thing I do is I get onto my left side. Okay? And that's quite similar to the sequence we want at the start of the downswing. Okay? So, a simple feeling to get this motion going is I want you to take a sponge like I've got here in my pocket. Okay? We're going to place it on the floor just there. Okay? We're going to put our left foot on top of the sponge just roughly in the middle of the foot there. Take our address position. Okay? After I turn and wind it to the top, the first move I'm going to think about is trying to squeeze that sponge with my left foot. Okay? Squeeze the sponge with your left foot from the top. What this is going to do, it's going to get your lower half working first, okay? And when your lower half works first, you get a good transition from that feeling of squeezing the sponge onto your left side, okay? And from there, the rest of your body can get pulled through. We'll get the left side going onto the left. Then you'll get your upper body and then your arms will be pulled lastly into position, which is the correct sequence we want to get on the downswing, okay? So, give it a try next time. Next time you're on the range, just swing it to the top and really imagine that sponge under your left foot like you're going to squeeze it from the top. After you've felt that squeeze into the ground and that transition, you can turn through and complete your swing. And what you're going to get is a better transition, better sequence in the downswing and hopefully a better shot.